Gabriella. What verses will we be reading today? Verses 13 through 15. Great. Let's begin. Refuge in Egypt. Now when they had departed, behold, an angel of the Lord appeared to Joseph in a dream, saying, Arise, take the young child and his mother, flee to Egypt, and stay there until I bring you word. For Herod will seek the young child to destroy him. When he arose, he took the, the child and his mother by night and departed for Egypt and was there until the death of Herod, that it might be fulfilled which was spoken by the Lord through the prophet, saying, Out of Egypt I call my son. Great reading. Thanks, Gabriella. So, in our reading today, we are at the point just after the wise men left Jesus, and Joseph is the one who's looking after Jesus and Mary, actually protecting them. We call him Joseph the Betrothed, and he has a dream that Herod is going to come after them. Herod doesn't want another king around, and the wise men already told Herod that a new king was born. So, Joseph has this dream and that they better leave and go to Egypt. So everyone seems to be having a strong reaction to Jesus being born. And he's just a baby. But the wise men travel long distances to see him because they want to worship the new king. And Herod is trying to get rid of him because he's afraid that another king might take away his throne. Joseph and Mary want to protect Jesus, so they decide to move to Egypt. Moving is really hard, and it was even harder back then, away from family and friends, no cars, no trains, no planes. Jesus' birth changed the lives of many people, even when he was just a baby. You know, Jesus has changed my life, too. I want to live the way Jesus taught me how to live, to treat people the way Jesus taught me how to treat people, and to worship God the way Jesus taught me to worship. Imagine how Jesus has changed your life, too. So, thanks for reading, Gabriella. I'm Father Alexis, and remember, Christ is in our midst.